Guys? Yeah. Your iron your ironer is too hot. You gotta do it a little bit quicker. And go through. So in this case, ladies and gentlemen, um, in this case, what you'll need to do is again let's identify. So we don't we only have uh, one side of the triangle. And what we notice on those sides of the triangle is that they're cut in half. So therefore, this is called a bisector, right? So this is called a median. It's breaking the sides in half. Now, what do we know about the lengths of the medians compared to the sides of the triangles for two triangles that are similar? OK? I'll go and add it in today after lunch, OK? Thank you very much. So what did we talk about with the medians? Well, the medians, just like the altitude we did last Last problem, we can say that the ratio of my median to my other median is equivalent to the ratio of these lengths. Well, if this is 6 and that's 6, that's 12, and that's 28. OK? So now. What? No, we did. That's not a length of a triangle. The whole length of the triangle is 12, right? And then remember the proportions of your ratio, or your proportions of your medians, OK? So now we have to cross multiply. Well, 21 times 12. Yes, yes, what was that, Dustin? What was the question? Oh, you didn't have a question. Oh, OK. So. 12 times 20. 252. 252. Why not? It's still equal 12. What's 21 times 12? 22. Okay. And x equals? Guys, I'm going to have to ask you this. Right? x equals 9. 